Okay, this is a relatively straightforward net present value problem. Uh, we're just looking at a single year time period here and ju just to illustrate the point. Uh, essentially what we're doing here is that we have a cash flow available of $723 that's available in one year. However, that cash flow is going to cost us right off the bat $430.63. So we can basically set this up and set this up in, in our cash flow scenario, right? We set out our, our, our number of years running along like this. Um, so we're going to have initially right now, it's at inception, right now it's going to cost us $430.63, right? And we don't have to discount this because this is coming to us right now. Then we're looking at in one year, we have a $723 positive payment, okay? And we don't have anything else coming out here in year two or year three. Okay? But what we do have to do is we have to discount that $723, right? And we are given a discount rate here of 26%. So it's going to be 1.26, okay? And this is going to be equal to our net present value. We are looking at what our cost to us right now is, and then we are discounting all our cash flows right back. So when we plug all this stuff in is that we're still going to have this negative 430.63 plus when we discount that $723, that's going to tell us that we have a value here of $573.00. And 81 cents, right? So that cash flow, that 723 is a positive value, right? At 573, it's going to cost us $430.63. And so that means when we just add those two numbers together, that means that we're going to have an NPV equal to $143.18. Okay. And so the basic question here is, should we do this? Yes, this is absolutely worth it, right? I am generating a 26% return on my money, right? Plus, I have this extra amount here of 143.18. So this is absolutely something that we should be doing.